Hello, my name is Snorf, and I'm bringing you another Wii Sports Club news video onto my channel. I've decided that I'm going to be making four or five parts um, because um, there's just simply loads of information. If I just bundled it into one video, then I'm sure you guys would just get, you know, bamboozled with the amount of information um, just in one video. So that's why I'm going to be splitting um, the news topics into four or five parts. Um, it's like in the next video I'm going to be talking about the e up and all of that. And in the video after that I'm going to focus on Wii Sports Club Tennis. But um, for now I'm just going to focus on the general information and some Miiverse features as well. So basically Wii Sports Club was originally titled Wii Sports U. Um, I'm just going to read out the interview. Um... Iwata said, the title this time isn't Wii Sports U, but Wii Sports Club. What is the background behind that? Shimamura, that email from you played a big part of it. You requested that we must definitely put Miiverse to good use. So we thought about how that should work. But if we were to simply implement Miiverse to a sporting game, the winners would probably write cheerful comments like, yay or won, but I bet the losers would hardly write anything at all. Like, oh, I'm so frustrated, I lost. Iwata then said it would overflow with comments from people who won. Shimamura, we were concerned that Miiverse, <coughs> excuse me, would become a cruel place. We also thought many people who play Wii Sports would have never played competitive games online. Iwata then said if Miiverse overflowed with the um, boasts of strong players, People playing online for the first time would lose heart. Shimmer more than replied, and it would be difficult to say to someone that they should play Wii Sports Club with their friends if they don't have anyone on hand who they could play with online. So we came up with a way to group people by their regions like states, provinces and um, prefectures. Everyone has a hometown or some place where they live. So we thought about setting it up in a way as if at first, you join the sports club in the area where you live. I water, that's how it became Wii Sports Club instead of Wii Sports U. I'm now going to be talking about um, the club features in Wii Sports Club. And again, I'm just going to read out the interview. But online players are grouped into regions like states, provinces and prefectures. Clubs compete against other regional clubs. Each club has a ranking, shows winning percentage, national ranking, club rankings change virtually in real time. Rankings also show average and total scores for each sport. Regions can compete against each region around the world. So this just sounds so epic, I think. It really does. And I'm just going to read out um, the section where they talk about this in the um, Iwata Asks. Iwata, people do tend to favour their own town and country's team. Shimamura then replied, that's why we decided to make it a match between everyone's home teams. Iwata then said, could you tell me exactly what happens when you join your home team? Makino then butts in and says, broadly speaking, there are two parts. One is the club ranking. For example, players in Japan can see the Tokyo's club winning percentage in tennis and where they place in the national ranking. And for the most part, the ranking changes in real time. I water, so the rankings are different every time you look at it. Makino, yes. I water, but in regional competition, there will be places with tons of people and places with less people. Makino then said, if we had made it to be just a competition of which region has the most wins, there, there would of course be a great divide between the populated and the not so populated regions. So we went with winning percentages. Iwata then said, So players in clubs with a small population bear a lot of responsibility. Makino then said, They sure do. But if they win, their ranking may shoot up all at once. Suzuki then says, And if they lose, it could be the opposite. Makino then says, The other part is the average score for members of the club to which you belong. In bowling, for example, you may learn that the average score is about 180. Then if you're only coming up with about 130, you may think, I need to try a little harder. I want to then respond saying it motivates you. Makino then says, right, in addition to the average score, 
He will also display the total number of pins knocked down so far among other um, statistics. I water then said, so even if you aren't that good, you could contribute to raising the score if you keep playing. Makino, that's right. While we were debugging the total number of pins reach hundreds of thousands, after service begins, it would be interesting if Miiverse lights up with talk about why a certain prefecture has so many pins. Iwata, in that way, having regions compete with each sport works well for a sports game. Shimamura, I think so. I would be happy if Miiverse fills up with comments, passionate with lots of people, with love of people's homelands. Mikino, suppose for example you look at the club ranking and the Tokyo club is higher than yours, then it would be great if you can get together with people in your club and compete against them posting on Miiverse with something like today's rival was a Tokyo club let's get them seriously I'm really excited about this club's feature it really does seem like they fought through um, with this it really does sound really really interesting um, the next thing I'm going to be talking about is Miiverse Miiverse posts show up during gameplay to cheer people on Miiverse posts are specific to certain accomplishments achieved while playing. These Miiverse posts are handwritten, creating a more personalised touch. But there also is the option, if you want to, to um, use the um, built-in Wii U gamepad to um, type out um, your message on there if you don't want to use the um, handwriting um, tool. Online banter feature allows players in instant to instantly send out brief messages online banter messages are pre-screened by meverse moderators when waiting for other players to join an online game you can play alone meverse or me characters get frustrated you can tell you're playing against real person because you know when you know if they like if they lose a point in tennis um you can see them just swinging the, the racket and you actually get to see the racket on screen. Um, so I'm just going to read out the parts of the interview um, where they talk about this. I Iwata, what kinds of other features are there? I heard comments show up on the screen during gameplay. Shimamura, yes, the game displays Miiverse posts that show up during the game to cheer people on. I Iwata, you write those to cheer people on? Shimamura, yes, that's right. You write them in, in advance. In bowling, for example, if I'm playing alone by myself and I get a strike, I might get a comment from someone in a Kyoto club saying, congrats on the strike. I water. Even if you're playing alone, people in the same club can compliment you. Shimamura, right. If you pick up a difficult spare, they might say, oh, nice job. Uh, I water. I like how the comments can change depending on the situation. Unlike with a computer, you can sense a real person behind it. Shimamura and their handwritten. So the fact that it's using Miiverse really comes alive. Of course you can use the Wii U gamepad to input messages using the keyboard, but it's simply very pleasing to see a rough sketch of a bowling pin next to a handwritten comment like, congrats on the strike. I water, you can sense the feelings and the warmth of those rooting for you. Shimamura. Exactly. If you connect Wii U to the internet, people in your area will cheer for you even when you play alone. We also have a communication feature called online banter. You're able to set messages you create in advance to the D-pad. When you have an online game against someone, you can toss out brief messages during the game like, I'm going to get a strike or eat this serve. But if it were in real time like chat, it would interrupt gameplay. Shimamura, that's right, and someone might say something that strikes some people the wrong way. So first you submit them to Miiverse, and then you can use them about an hour later. Um, so I think that's why, um, you know, they're not going to be, be no, it's not going to be any voice chat on Wii Sports Club. They don't want, you know, people just to be offensive on there. Um, especially so, like, if you're a kid and, um, you know, you're on there and you just, some 4 to old bloke raiders at you, oh, you're shit, and all of that. I think that's why there's no voice chat. But I think they could have easily implemented voice chat. And, you know, when you start up the game, you could have a message, you know, for parents saying, oh, this game uses voice chat. Do you want to use this feature? Yes or no. 
and then if you press no you won't hear people speaking um, I think that's what they could have done there um, just going to carry on with the interview I water it set up so there aren't any in inappropriate comments Shimamura, yeah we did that because parents might worry about what people would say when their children play and with Wii Sports Club we won't want people playing an online game for the first time to have a bad experience later we'll see the online banter in action um, obviously I, I, I can't show that because um, I don't think there's any gameplay of it to be honest with you um, Shimamura something else we talked about during development was how it would be a shame if people felt like the person they were playing was actually, excuse me, was actually at the computer, because the players move positions automatically in Wii Sports Tennis, I water. But with online banter, the fact that you're playing a real person gets across much more. Shimamura, right. In addition to that, we put on some things so that it's more obvious that you're playing a real person. In tennis, for example, it's now Wii Remote Plus compatible. So if you'll simply move the racket like this, spins hand, the me character on the screen will move the same way. I water, oh you can see things like that too, spins hand the same way as Shimamura. You can see your opponent doing this, Shimamura, yeah it shows up, that way the me characters move a completely different way than a computer would and you can tell your rival is a real person. If you smash the ball into the corner of your opponent's court, can even tell that your opponent is frustrated. I water. You can see that your opponent is swinging around their racket and stomping in frustration. Shimamura exactly. In the game controlled by buttons, the motions show only what has been programmed into the buttons. But in Wii Sports Club, the racket moves how you move the Wii Remote Plus, so you know when they're ticked or pissed or you know whatever. I water. That's how you can tell you're playing a real person. Shimamura, that's why we were always grinning as we tested online gameplay. Um, and then they go on to talk about, um, you know, the development of um, Wii Sports Club Online. And, you know, they're in one, um, they're in the old headquarters and then they were playing against somebody in the new headquarters. And, you know, normally they don't do this. Normally the whole team is in one place. Um... So, yeah, that's pretty much all I have to say in this video, guys. A lot of information covered. Um, I, I can't really summarise it because there's just so much information. I end up spending the next five minutes just summarising it. But, yeah, Wii Sports Club was originally tied to Wii Sports U. There's a lot of Miiverse features as well. Um, so, yeah, that's why I'm glad I kind of split up the videos a bit because I'm already 13 minutes into this video. There's a lot to cover and I'll definitely cover more information in my next couple of videos so i guess until then then i'll see you in those videos but in the meantime please don't forget to rate comment and subscribe to my channel if you found these videos useful it really does help me out and like i said i'll see you in my next wii sports club video goodbye